dairy breed gang over here. Yeah, you guys are getting the fresh water, I know. You want petted? You're getting used to me a little bit, slowly but surely. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another one. Uh, we're doing another auction video today. Uh, mainly because the video that I wanted to put up today just didn't work. I uh, wanted to go starling hunt yesterday. Shop is busy, didn't get it over to the dairy, so yeah. Looks like we're doing another auction one. And today is gonna be about something that I bought at the auction. It's actually hiding right back there, but uh, we'll get to that here in a second. Uh, going through this uh, auction footage, I was like, man, I should have bought so much stuff. Not that I need more stuff to take care of, but some of the stuff has been way too cheap. There's some stuff that went pretty high, but a lot of stuff that just went way, way, way too cheap. And uh, knowing what I know now, I probably could have made, I could have made a little bit flipping it at the next auction because uh, this auction footage is actually a little over a month old. So there's been other auctions since then. But Seamus. Seamus is not with us any longer. Um, he, I don't know what happened. Uh, he seemed to be acting fine in the morning and then came home that night and he was dead. Yeah. I noticed he was kind of standing off by himself a little bit, but not like anything weird weird. Yeah, he was being a goat. Um, didn't really pay that much attention to him until I came home. He was just laying out there. I was like, what is, and he was gone. So, um, yeah, my, <laughs> the best goat I had uh, is gone. But we still do have a bunch of my uh, garden trimmers here. Some of them are just fat and sassy. Um, I think Karen is probably packing a little bit of Seamus along with her. So hopefully she pops here the next month or two. But anyway, let's get in the video. Ooh, we got some fancy Polish. I don't know how to pronounce that right, but uh, yeah. They look cool. Wish there were some hens here. There's some more roosters. Some Samanis. We got a few of them at the house. These are the ones that are all black. Guts, bones, everything. Cool bird. There's those Polish that I showed you a second ago. Getting us some cochins. Uh, blue cochin. It says straight run, but uh, that one there might be the only hand. <laughs> A couple of silky roosters. Four more cochins. Hmm. Okay. Showgirls, typically it's the, the Turkin Silky Cross. You got the naked neck with the, uh, the silky body. Weird birds. Long crows, huh? huh. Interesting. Laughing chickens. Blue bands. Then there is a ton of ceramas and silkies, some sea brights. They used to have some of these. I had silvers though. Another long thrower. It's a pretty big cerama. Little silkies. I like that color. Pretty cool. A little big though. Cochins, more silkies, white ceramas, more silkies, more silkies, uh, more of those long crowers, this must be their breeder flock, I don't know if they're getting out of those or what, got a bunch of hatching eggs, I have my incubator off for the last couple months, but they go for the right price, you know, might be interested in those, 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 Maybe. What do we got? More Polish. And there's Polish everywhere here today. Bunch of Muscovies. Hopefully Muscovies go cheap. Not that I need any more, but uh, yeah. Always looking for more. Though most of these all seem like drakes. Look like real young drakes. More red chickens. Mixed a lot of hens there. 
Took some good pullets down at that end. Ericana flock. Probably a bit older. And are they barred rocks? Doesn't say. Right, the only reason I ask is that doesn't really look quite like it fits the bill or that one. It looks like mostly bards. What do we got? Looks like a bunch of buff pullets or hens. We got goats. Look at that. Looks like, what do we got here? Four month old, two Nubian, and two boar Nubian cross. Let's see. Are they all female? Looks like they might all be does. If they go cheap enough, I might have to take them home. Huh? You want to pet one? Can you, can you reach through and pet it? What about that one over there? Another group of red layers. Probably well, two year old hens, if I had to guess. I don't know what they are, but they're cool. Little BB red rooster. Pigeons. That's kind of cool. Like that right there. Oop. Hen and chicks. There's a pair of BB reds. Like probably crosses. Oh, oh these look cool. They look like silky frizzle crosses. That's pretty neat. Feathers grow the opposite way. A little mix lot. And a couple of hens. Couple of big boy roosters. That's kind of cool. Got some hens here. Says they're young, laying good. Got the silver laced, another silver laced. That blue one, so I'm gonna pick that one out. Good looking little flock. Then some more. The red hens with the white. Little thing here, it doesn't work on all breeds, but if you see their earlobe, like right there, that's white. And then on these, it's red. Typically, typically, not always, but if they have a red one, they lay uh, brown eggs. If they have a white one, they lay white eggs. Not always, it doesn't run across the board, but it probably nine times out of 10 is right. Very proud mama and her babies. Same situation here. Got all sorts of little stuff here. Sophie. Oh, rooster here. And black hen. Bunch of big black roosters. I don't know if those are Jersey Giants or what they are. Obviously that's a bar drop, but yeah. Looks like some Delaware cross maybe. Or as I say that's for that feathered foot there. Some other hens. Cool. I don't know if those are black Dutch or whatever they call them. Some old Muscovies. Bunch of younger looking birds though. Looks like there might be a hen or two in here. They're late enough in the sale. I might end up winning a couple of those. Yep. Maybe a few more in there as well. Got the rooster gang again. All sorts of different colors and sizes. Funky looking comb, dude. Bunch of rabbits. Back into the Polish again. A trio of white crested blacks. 
And then we got some silkies. These are nice young looking birds. Look like pullets there. Bet they go for a pretty good penny. I don't know what breed that is. I think it's a drake. A pair of Samanis. That's a cool chicken. Another pair. Doesn't say what kind they are. Those are cool. I do like that color pattern. You look a little bit aggressive, bud. Maybe not. We got a trio. Oh, those are cool. They look familiar, but I can't tell you what they are. Other than two roosters and a hen. One. I should have brought some turkeys. I was actually supposed to bring some turkeys because a couple of them were getting a little aggressive at the house. Um, last time they went for way more than what I thought they should have. We'll see this time though. Some more milk furs. If they go for cheap enough, I might have to take them home. Typically these go for way more than what they're worth. And there's a, another group of them. And a little white bird. And the biggest one, her mama gives me a gallon in the morning and a gallon at night, and she's a second year freshman. So. There you go. There you go. All ladies now are going to produce some out there. Guys, what? Hi, how do I come? What? How do we do? 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 Bunch of guinea keats. Some roosters. Big old French lock though. So that's what the tag says. Another one. Bunch of pecans. Well, that one's not a pecan obviously, but you know. Bunch more bunnies. Big old chunk. Look at the ears on them. What breed is that? It doesn't say. What are these French lops, maybe? Look at the size of those ears. And a black one. And we got a bunch more rabbits. That is a big runner. Really dark, too. Stands really straight. That's a cool bird. And his neck looks stupid long. Like unnaturally long. Might be one of the better runners I've seen in a while. Got some more drakes over here though. And a silky-ish. Either that or he's real old and molting. Bunch more beacons. I've got a pair at the house. I don't know if I need a few more or not. Might be kind of cool. That is a tiny pair. I'm guessing they're just real young. Yeah. More pigeons. American black. Looks like a Cayuga. Uh, okay. After reading that and thinking it looks like Cayuga and then seeing Silver Lace Wyandotte Roosters and it's definitely Barred Rock Roosters. Um, 
Yeah, I'm gonna go with it's Cayuga and some Bard Rocks. Sometimes you just don't know. People get it mixed up. Got some quail. Some more bunnies. Whoa. He's all buff runners. Look at cool. More guineas. Mm, maybe really young Africans. Or it could be a hen and a young one. I don't know. Some more roosters. There's a lot of roosters here today. Might only get a couple bucks for mine. Young ones. And yet another trio of Polish. A year or two ago, these were 40, 50 bucks a piece all day. A bunch more Muscovies. I bet that's Mama. A little older hen there. Another silky. Looks like some Araconas there. Young rooster. Yeah. That's a mystery, but it's a rooster. Couldn't tell you more than that. A couple more silky roosters. And a mixed lot. Now that they had to watch the whole thing just to get this far, should we show them the new baby? Hmm? Yeah, she likes to hang out with you guys, doesn't she? Yeah. Um, so we don't have a name for her. Hey, hi. Um, she's a pretty cool little goat. Um, uh, oh, oh, hey. Anyway, uh, she is one of those, you know, purebred Nubian. That's what they sold her as anyway. I can't prove it. I don't have any papers or anything, but she is just a nice little goat. Um, I'm pretty excited about her. My uncle sold his dairy goat buck. I just remembered that. It was La Macha. Um, same farm that these guys came from uh, originally. But uh, I probably will breed her back to a boar um, and see what she does as a mama goat for, you know, either extra milk or kids that, uh, you know, need fostered. You're just kind of a bully. But anyway, the people need to name you, don't they? Oh, don't be a fussy girl now. Um, yeah, what do you guys think? What does she look like? Help me name the goat. My kiddos haven't named it yet, so uh, we still got an opportunity to name it. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. A uh, lot more hunting footage coming up. That is the time of year that it is. Um, we will be doing some more stuff here at the farm. It's just a busy time of year for me and I'm doing the best I can. So uh, sorry, if, sorry if my uh, footage is not up to par. My schedule's been out of whack. Um, yeah, I'm doing the best I can though. So. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe. I'd appreciate it all, and uh, hopefully we'll see you guys in the next one.